when you improve your services to your clients, you fulfill several purposes in your business. One is you fulfill the overall purpose of your business, which is to provide, deliver your excellent service to change your clients' lives. Uh, but secondly, you also create word of mouth marketing, which is the most authentic marketing there is. It's when clients actually experience your service, right? And then they talk about that with other people. Uh, that's the most authentic marketing when someone actually has an embodied experience with you and then they can talk authentically about what it was like and how much they loved it so uh, in these short videos that I've been making one of the topics I've been I've been giving you is ideas to improve your services right so I encourage you to watch watch those t videos um, I'm gonna give you one more idea today which is to take a survey of your clients 25% of the way through they're working with you so for example if you sign up your clients for a six month package then 25% of the way is about a month and a half into their working with you or if you sign your clients up for a 12 month package then it's three months into their their time with you the idea is to uh, that now that they've had enough experience working with you they can tell you what they love about working with you uh, and your services and also what you could improve on to make your service even more effective and delightful for them and really, if you aren't asking your clients how you can improve your service to them, you are missing a really, um, uh, you're really missing a big piece of data about uh, how you can improve your business. And so that's what I, and in the notes to this video, I will include an actual link to a survey that you can feel free to use or copy. And um, I will also include some ideas that you could use to get more uh, get more survey results uh, when one idea I'll share with you quickly is to give a deadline for responding to the survey a due date um, so when you email them out uh, email that survey link to them say you know I would um, I would really love for you to respond by Friday because then I can really start implementing your ideas to make my service even better for you and so let's say you send it on a Monday, you ask for it by Friday, then when you set a due date, you can then, you then have a very good reason to follow up and remind them to fill it out. So maybe on Thursday to say, all right, got one day remaining, please click this link and take just three minutes and let me know what is working for you about our service and what's one thing that I can change to improve it. Um, and what I actually also do is I make the survey form anonymous. So they can put their name if they want, but I, I really frame it as, hey, this is an anonymous survey, anonymous feedback for George Cow, and uh, you, can on, you can respond honestly. This is going out to all of my clients, so please respond honestly. You don't have to put your name if you don't want to. What happens is I find that just about everyone puts their name anyway, but uh, it gives them the sense of freedom that they can respond as honestly as they want. So I hope this is helpful. Um, I would love to know if you have any ideas for like a regular process of improving one's service to one's clients. I'd love to know. Comment below this video and always open to your questions as well. So until the next video, I wish you well.